heat exchangers are used in a variety of marine applications from power generation to steam production it is impossible to operate a cargo ship without heat exchangers today we are going to take a closer look at one of the most common types the shell and the tube heat exchanger and the plate type heat exchanger but before that please do subscribe to our youtube channel and do not forget to click on the bell icon heat exchangers are vital components in marine engineering and play a critical role in the efficient operation of a ship's machinery by cooling down the operating temperature of various machinery and mediums shell and tube type heat exchanger The shell and tube type heat exchanger is one of the most commonly used types in the maritime industry. It consists of four main components: the shell, the tube bundle, the baffle plate, and the tube sheets. The shell is a cylindrical vessel that provides a housing for the tube bundle. The tube bundle consists of a series of tubes that are mounted inside the shell. The baffle plates are mounted inside the shell and are used to direct the flow of fluid through the tube bundle. During operation, the hot fluid flows through the tubes while the cooling fluid flows through the shell. As the fluid flows through the heat exchanger, thermal energy is transferred from the hot fluid to the cooling fluid. The baffle plates inside the shell cause the fluid to flow in a serpentine pattern, increasing the amount of time the fluid spends in contact with the tubes and maximizing the heat transfer efficiency. Plate type heat exchanger. A plate type heat exchanger is also one of the widely used heat exchanger type on ships. It is compact, efficient, and easy to maintain. It consists of stacks of thin metal plates typically made of stainless steel. The plates are corrugated to increase their surface area and to provide channel for fluid flow. Plates are separated by a gasket that seals the channels and prevents mixing of the two fluids. The plates are stacked with each other in the cooler frame. which consists of a head and a follower column which makes the end frames of the exchanger the lower and upper bar in which plates are arranged and tie bolts which compresses all plates together the operation of a plate type heat exchanger is straightforward The cold fluid is introduced through another inlet port and flows through the channels in the even numbered plates. The hot fluid is introduced into the heat exchanger through an inlet port and flows through the channels in the odd numbered plates. As the hot fluid flows through the channels, it gives off heat to the metal plates. The cold fluid absorbs the heat from the metal plates as it flows through the channels. The two fluids exit the heat exchanger through separate outlet ports. The hot fluid is now cooler and the cold fluid is now warmer. The heat transfer process continues as long as the two fluids flow through the heat exchanger. A plate type heat exchanger is a simple and efficient device used on ships to transfer heat between two fluids. Its compact size, ease of maintenance, and high heat transfer rates make it a popular choice for marine applications.